full gamut of emotions in those last couple of minutes. An 89th minute equaliser then succumbing to the 92nd minute winner from Forest Green. What's your reaction? Um, <laughs> it's a difficult question to answer really because uh, we've come we've come here to team at the top of the league. Um, they've changed their formation during the course of the second half. Um, we were obviously uh, in a position where we stopped them playing their style of football also. Uh, yes, they did create chances against us for sure. But uh, to get the equaliser and to concede right at the end is, is, is a cruel blow really to the players and to the, the fans that come here on a, on a bitterly cold day. Um, and to go away with nothing is uh, just tough to take at the moment. And it, it was a magnificent effort throughout the second half, building towards yeah. that equaliser. You, yeah. you, you sensed that something had been coming. Do you think, for that second half performance, we deserved something? I think so. Uh, I do. I think you know, we've, we've went away to Dagenham, we've come away to Forest Green, uh, and put in two very good performances, and we've ended up with uh, zero points, which is, I think, is cruel, really. Um, you know, Forest Green. Let's take it away from them. They're a very, very good side in the way they play. Uh, is very difficult, but you know they changed their formation. Um, obviously, to to have a go at us, but I think that was maybe partly due to the way our players played during the course of the second half. Uh, yeah, um, we're, we're bitterly disappointed. And it shows the fine margins once again between success and failure. But it also shows, really, that we're not far away from the from the teams that are the the, the genuine favourites for promotion. Yeah, as a touch on there, the two sides that we've played away recently, uh, we've given a good account of ourselves. But, you know, I, I would say it was a mistake uh, towards the end, you know, where it's gone out for a throw in, where we could have dealt with it better. Um, ball comes into our box, and it's a, it's a very good header to, to, to win the football match. But uh, uh, it's, it's a difficult one at the moment, you know, just coming out of the dressing room um, because. The effort that the players put in, the way they played second half, um, you know, they took on board what was said at half time, um, and they put that into in, into practice and didn't get nothing from it. What was said at half time? Forest Green seemed to be good value for their their half time lead, but you changed it round and to great effect. Well, first half we we gave, we regained possession, then give it straight straight back to them, which against a, t uh, a team as good as Forest Green, if you do that, they're going to hurt you, um, and they did. Second half, we, we identified uh, areas where we could go and hurt them, which the players knew about before coming into the game, because um, we went through it with them during the course of the week, uh, and for whatever reason, they didn't put that into, into play during the course of the first half. <laughs> we reminded the lads at half-time um, where we could go and hurt them, and they put it into play, so, you know, if we'd have done that at the beginning, who knows what the outcome would have been. But you know, to fight back against a very, very good, talented Forest Green side, uh, and then to concede very, very uh, late on, um, it's a cool blow. Yeah. <laughs> I keep saying that and repeating myself, but it is. It yeah, is no.